Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and this is an update to the Windows 10 May 2019 update rollout that started yesterday. So if you've seen my videos of course you can now download it from the Microsoft website. You can also um, download or get possibly get it through the Windows update. Um, there are some known issues. Some people were asking, uh, I've heard somebody say there were some known issues or read it somewhere. There are some known issues that is uh, that Microsoft uh, knows about and they're look, looking at it. Um, and what are they? Because a lot of you are asking. So um, there could be a possibility that your display brightness will not respond to the adjustments that you're giving it. So if that happens, it's a known issue they're investigating. Um, there's a duplicate folder and documents uh, showing in user profile directory. So when you go to the File Explorer, if you look at the uh, different uh, user profiles, if you notice that, for example, you had documents, and you go into documents and there's nothing, it's empty, don't panic. There's a dupl duplicate of that document folder that exists in the same place. And when you look at it, uh, that the other one no has all of your files in it. There's some kind of duplication happening there. And it happens with the known folders like desktop, documents, pictures, uh, and so on and it's just that it's redirecting to an empty folder but the uh, folders are still there and they still have stuff in it so if you got some problems if you're using Dolby Atmos headphones and home theater uh, audio might not be working right now with uh, these uh, Dolby Atmos home theater so this is something that they know about and they of course uh, say that it's a really a, a minor like for example the duplicate folder is only a minor subset of people that actually have that problem show up so they decided that it was you know not um, of, of uh, important enough to prevent the release of the May 2019 update there's also mitigated issues issues that are not fixed but they've actually turned around and, and kind of did a, did a uh, temporary fix that um, makes it work anyways uh, Intel audio displays uh, that have ENTCDO, uh, DAUD dot SYS notification. Uh, there's a range of Intel Display Audio device drivers that may result in battery drain. Uh, error attempting to update with external USB device or memory card attached. Uh, older versions of BattleEye anti cheat software are in incompatible. Unable to discover or connect to Bluetooth devices in some cases. Uh, with some versions of Realtek and Qualcomm Bluetooth uh, radio drivers. Nightlight settings do not apply in some cases. Uh, cannot launch the camera app. Uh, some older devices may experience losing Wi-Fi due to an outdated Qualcomm driver. AMD RAID drivers incompatibility. Um, so certain computers run certain versions of AMD RAID drivers. So it's really older uh, hardware when you look at most of the fixes and the problems, a lot of them are and have to do with older hardware. Uh, some direct 3D application in games may fail to enter full screen mode on rotated displays. So if you're on a tablet, for example. And these are mitigated. There's some of the fixes and some are temporarily being uh, fixed in a way that and, and there will be some updates. But most of them are for older stuff, older hardware. Uh, and older drivers that have not been updated in a while. So most modern computers won't have any glitches. So that's pretty much what we know about the Windows 10 May 2019 update. We'll have more, of course, today on this because a lot of people are asking questions. And we'll go through another questions and answer today uh, for sure. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.